logging calls and keeping track of all of the information inside of Lizzie or inside of any CRM system for that matter is one thing. But being able to go back and get to that data and to have that data be as intelligent as it possibly can be is a really important aspect to us for the, the whole purpose in logging the call to begin with. So in this video, what I want to do is actually show you, now that we've logged a few phone calls, how to get to those calls and how to research information about those calls, along with how Lizzie actually goes about threading all of the individual telephone calls to help us with, with this review process. And so to get started, what we're going to do is we're going to start with the actual contact record. So we're looking at the contact that we had created earlier, Brian Smith at PQI and we are going to view the correspondence. Now there's a couple different ways to get to the correspondence. We can select it over here on the left or we can select the, main, the little button up here on the right. Either one of those will bring us to the view correspondence page. Now instead of just showing you a, a whole list of notes and dates and, and that kind of stuff, what we do is we initially show you all of the unresolved topics so you'll first be presented with the unresolved topics, then you'll be presented with all of the individual phone calls that have taken place with respect to that particular customer and the different reps that you have working for you or with you depending on your position. Um, when you go into this control, if I wanted to look at the detail, for example, looking at this particular record here, I can see who made the phone call and if I select view, it'll open up the detail about that particular item. But in some situations, and it just so happens that this particular unresolved topic has got some linked phone calls, they're threaded phone calls within that topic, I will have an additional option here of view linked items. And when I click that, it will actually open up the specific phone calls that have been linked to this particular topic all in one nice, easy to follow view. So instead of me having to go in and try to decide which phone calls went with what topic and you know we talked about three different things, what's I'm over here and I'm having to dig through and try to find the information I'm looking for, I can instead let Lizzie, through the act of logging the phone call, let Lizzie thread all of this stuff and keep everything related where it should be related. Now, in addition to these functions, I can also see that this particular call or this topic has a callback scheduled for it. We can see the opportunity that went along with this particular callback or with this particular topic, and we can go in and change that information here if we need to. We can resolve this topic if we need to. And just a, another example of the level of integration that we're talking about here is because an opportunity is tied to a topic. And because the topic is unresolved whenever it's open, if I were to go in and resolve that topic, I am essentially getting rid of the opportunity as well because I've basically said, look, this, op this topic is no longer valid, it's no longer open, and therefore anything that's tied to it, and that includes callbacks, it includes you know, the opportunities, if I select that that particular thing is resolved, Lizzie will automatically go and update everybody's calendar that had a callback, it'll remove any opportunities that were there, and, and now the opportunity will still visibly be here, but you will not see it on any of your reporting because we basically closed that topic. Um, the other things that, that we can do here on this particular page is up here at the top, I have the added ability to be able to go in and only view calls for a specific rep in the company, or I can go in and select that I only want to look at calls or emails or face-to-face. I can select that I only want to look at specific call types or a date range that I want to actually stay between. I, I know that I talked to this person between Monday and Tuesday of last week. I can narrow down all of the conversations for me for that particular period of time and try to drill into exactly which correspondence that I'm looking for. So as you can see, we don't only log calls and, and say that we log calls and give you a note filled with a bunch of information in it. We actually keep everything very, very detailed and very, very much linked together and as intelligent as possible so that you can then turn around and get back to that data and see things that you might not have otherwise been able to see. 
The other thing that I want to say before we get through here is that there's a lot of reports available. Um, I can run call log reports. I can also, there's a, a, a nice graph that you can run for your sales staff to see how they are performing week to week or month to month in their call volume. You know, how much time are they on the phone? How many times have they made calls? And you can even compare that department to the support department or, you know, however you want to go about doing the, the comparisons. Um, so all of the information that you're taking the time to log on the front end, it's extremely easy to get back at that data on the back end to get pretty much any kind of report or any kind of information that you're looking for.